and welcome to the session. Let's discuss the following question. The question says, the taxi fare in a city is as follows. For the first kilometer, the fare is rupees 8 and for the subsequent distance, it is rupees 5 per kilometer. Taking the distance covered as x kilometer and the total fare as rupees y, Write a linear equation for this information and draw its graph. Let's now start the solution. Total distance covered is x kilometer. Now in x kilometer, first kilometer is covered at rupees 8 and the subsequent distance, that means x minus 1 kilometer, is covered at rupees 5 per kilometer. So, for the first kilometer, the fare is Rupees 8 and for the subsequent distance fair is rupees x minus 1 into 5. It is given that total fare is rupees y. Now this means fare for the first kilometer plus fare for the subsequent distance is equal to rupees y. Therefore, 8 plus x minus 1 into 5 is equal to y. And this implies 8 plus 5x minus 5 is equal to y. And this implies 5x plus 3 is equal to y. And this implies 5x minus y plus 3 is equal to 0. This is the required linear equation. Now we have to draw the graph of this equation. So for drawing the graph we need at least two solutions of this equation. So let's now find the two solutions of this equation. When x is equal to 0, then the given equation reduces to 5 into 0 minus y plus 3 is equal to 0. And this implies minus y plus 3 is equal to 0. And this implies y is equal to 3. And when y is equal to 0, then the given equation reduces to 5x minus 0 plus 3 is equal to 0. And this implies 5x plus 3 is equal to 0. And this implies x is equal to minus 3 by 5. Let's now represent these solution in the tabular form. So let's make a table. When x is equal to 0, then y is equal to 3. And when y is equal to 0, then x is equal to minus 3 by 5. Let's now plot these points on the graph. We have drawn the two axes, x and y. These two axes are perpendicular to each other. The point of intersection of these two axes is the origin. At the origin, both the x coordinate and y coordinate is 0. And we know that x coordinate is also known as abscissa and y coordinate is also known as ordinate. Now, these are the two solutions which we have found out. So, let's now plot these points on the graph. Now the first point is 0, 3. This means when abscissa is 0, then ordinate is 3. So this is the required point 0, 3. 
Now the next point is minus 3 by 5, 0. This means when ordinate is 0, then abscissa is minus 3 by 5. That means minus 0 0.6. So this is the point minus 3 by 5, 0. Now we will join these two points by a straight line. This is the line which is representing the equation 5x minus y plus 3 is equal to 0. So this completes the session. Bye and take care.